guys. So if you're anything like me, your Google Drive is a hot mess after last year being virtual. So let's clean it up today. The first thing I'm going to show you how to do is create a new folder in your Google Drive. This will help you have a place to drag and drop or to send all of those pesky little things in your drive to. To create a new folder, click on the new button, click folder, and a new folder will open up. Title the folder whatever you want. I'm going to just put everything from last school year into one folder. So I'm going to title this 2020 2021 school year. Oops. Now, if you know me, which you probably do, I love emojis. So I'm going to go to Emojipedia and I'm going to find an emoji to add to my folder. I'm going to add the school emoji. Copy it, go back to my folder, click at the front and paste it right there and click create. Now it kind of gets lost in all these folders, right? Well, let's change the color of the folder to help us find it easier. I'm going to make it red. So now this folder is red and everything's easier in it. So I can, I can grab other folders and drop them in or I can grab a folder right click on it, click move to, and click on where I want to move it to, which is the 2020-2021 school year folder. Now, for all of your assignments or all of your loose documents, you can do the same thing. So say you want to move this to your school year folder, right click on it, click move to, and click on the folder you want to move it to. Now it's gone. You can change all of the, all the settings you want on your folders and they'll stay. And you can even open up your folder and within your folder, add a new folder. What? So this is going to be student work. Create. I can also color it the same color as my out external folder. And then I can drag and drop my student work that I moved into that folder. Remember, drag and drop is your friend. Also, if you wanted to add multiple folders or multiple documents, you can click on the folder you want to move, then hit control and click on another one. Control, click on another, click on another, click on another, and then move all of those by dragging and dropping into that folder. Now they're all there. I hope this helps you clean up your classroom and get started with fresh with a new year. See you next time.